a ghost or spirit is the invisible presence to translucent or lifelike visions. We count down and this list scary videos of allegedly real ghosts caught on tape. Real videos from people who claim to have had strange real ghost sightings and supernatural encounters in real life. So here are top 10 real ghost sightings caught on CCTV. Scary ghost videos. Before we begin make sure you hit that subscribe button to get notified every day for more amazing content. Ghostly figure of a woman. A personal trainer captured what he believes is the spine tingling moment he saw the ghost of Lord Nelson's estranged wife aboard the HMS Victory. In eerie footage, the ghostly figure of a woman in a dress and heels walks through the upper chamber of the warship before seemingly disappearing through a wall. He was enjoying a day out last week on the vessel, which was Lord Nelson's flagship in the Battle of Trafalgar, when he started to feel like someone, or something, was following him. The 33-year-old, who has a passion for paranormal investigation, quickly got out his video camera and panned around the chamber. While he didn't see anything with his naked eye, when Tony watched the footage back he had clearly captured a womanly figure, who he believes is the ghost Francis Fanny Nelson. A ghost spotted at crash. An eerie figure spotted in a crash scene video has sent chills down the spines of viewers who apparently think it might be an alien or a ghost. The video was filmed by a witness in the aftermath of a collision between a van and a car in the city of Sapoleti, in the central Argentine province of Rio Negro. It shows a car flipped over on its side and a man leaning in its open door to talk to a victim trapped inside. But standing by an open ambulance door, a mysterious grey figure is can be seen. It looks almost like the person is wearing a mask with sunglasses over the top. Some people said that it was a ghost or an alien visitor come for a peek at a human disaster. Restaurant Poltergeist In this CCTV footage was captured inside Jimmy's World Grill and Bar in Luton UK. The video, which is less than 2 minutes long, shows poltergeist activity in the calm restaurant. Most of the activity occurs at the table in the bottom center of the frame. A female customer is enjoying a meal alone, which is all that can be seen for the first 50 seconds or so of the footage. The customer walks away from her table and her chair moves on its own as she is away. Her napkin, plate, and cutlery are thrown violently off the table. Many customers and employees look in the direction of the accident, but see nothing unusual. The noise was later reported a manager who walked over to find the broken plate and mess. I didn't think too much of it at the time, but when talking to the staff about it a couple of days later they joked about it being a ghost, said the manager. Eventually the staff was curious enough to check the security footage when they stumbled upon this alleged proof of supernatural existence. A ghost girl. A ghost girl has been caught on camera haunting a bank. Eyewitnesses say the young girl aged about 10 appeared from nowhere and ran behind them. But just as quickly as she appeared the little girl vanished into thin air. The bizarre scene was caught on camera at a branch of the credit bank BCP in the Peruvian capital Lima. The footage opens with the cameraman standing behind a seated female colleague and chatting to a man leaning on a desk. The figure of a little girl appears to run through the office behind the man. The cameraman says, I have just seen a girl crossing there, the crying girl. What you think about it? Is it real ghost girl, or hoax? Let me know in the comments. A ghost caught in prison. A ghost hunter claims he has filmed chilling footage of the last man hanged in Cornwall inside Britain's most haunted prison. The eerie apparition was caught on camera at Bodmin Jail. He decided to visit the notorious Cornish prison, along with his wife Bev, as it is the site where some of the country's worst criminals were executed. After making sure they were the only visitors in the famous attraction, the couple say they captured many supernatural incidents. These included faint voices strange electronic voice phenomena and light orbs flying around the rooms. He said its spookiest moment was when the lights went completely white before what appears to be the full figure of a ghost turned up in an empty corridor. They have seen this ghost and were shocked at some of the captures. Ghost Mash Glass A landlady is convinced her pub is haunted after a pint glass shattered on its own. 
The glass exploded near a man's hand as he was stood chatting near the bar at the Fox Eating and Drinking House in East Grinstead. Spooky CCTV shows customers reacting in shock after the glass shatters Claire Cassie co-owner of the Boozer insisted that the incident was not a stunt. The mother of two, who believes in ghosts and spirits, said she thinks the pub could be haunted. Old Pete's Ghost This video was published by YouTuber in November 2015. The alleged spirit, which is thin, white and slightly reflective, moves quickly between cars with no apparent destination. Although in some shots the apparition looks like a floating sheet, other angles provide details such as shoulders and a head. The figure moves randomly across the parking lot occasionally disappearing from the frame. Before the video ends it quickly shoots to the left. The description claims that the ghost noticed the camera and fled the scene. It also adds some insight to the possible origins of the spirit. Perhaps it is one of the ghosts from the nearby Old South Fremantle Power Station believed to be haunted by many gals. Could also be a friend of the Davilak ghost from the Azalea Le homestead nearby, said Mazdafria. This footage is just a small example of the alleged paranormal occurrences at this location. According to this user, several pieces of evidence have been collected to support the theory of a paranormal presence. Unfortunately, that evidence was never uploaded. Ghost in an abandoned house. A bricklayer believes he encountered ghostly goings on while working on a Georgian house in Bristol. Chris Chalker and colleague Darren Vowles were working on the basement of the property in Portland when they experienced what they describe as paranormal activity. The building is in the middle of an extensive renovation and conversion into apartments and the pair were laying bricks around a new lift shaft when things got creepy. He decided to start filming the dark and eerie cellar and small white objects are visible flying past the camera. He has dissected the footage and believes he can make out several shapeless paranormal forms in the darkness and even a headless figure cradling a baby. RAF Pilot Ghost A man turned ghost hunter has revealed spooky footage of the ghost of an RAF pilot haunting a corridor in an abandoned Air Force base. He visited Manby Hall, in Lincolnshire, earlier this year with his ghost hunts team, and could not believe his luck when he captured the freaky footage. The team didn't realize that an unknown figure wanders through the background until looking at the video later that night, but Steve insists it could not have been any of his team and there was no one else in the building. Manby was a key area for the RAF during WWII and the hall was once used as an RAF base as well as an old people's home before closing down. Leaflet throwing ghost. This is the spine chilling moment a suspected poltergeist started flinging books and leaflets off bookshelves in front of spooked museum staff, like something out of a Ghostbusters film. The spooky CCTV footage shows David Wills and his colleagues stood in the shop in Torquay Devon, chatting to each other when chaos unexpectedly breaks out on the other side. When he first sees that some leaflets have dropped from the shelf he rushes over to pick them up. Then suddenly, without warning, another pile of leaflets flies off the shelf right in front of Mr. Will's eyes. The museum researcher looks stunned in the footage and can be seen pointing at the shelf where the leaflets flew from. As a startled colleague rushes to his side they can both be seen looking confused at the stack of paper left lying on the floor. The pair leave the pile, where it is sat, and both scupper from the museum shop as fast as they can. This is not the first spine tingling incident to have happened at the museum in recent years. If you like my video, don't forget like and subscribe my channel, let us comments below.